Hello guys, this is the new Note Icon Blue Sound from Canada, high tech product. It's a headphone amplifier, it's a streamer, it's the flagship from the company. There is a screen display LCD of 5 inch. On the top we have a, a sensor, when we approach our figures, light up the buttons. Now we see a clock here and the date. There is a headphone amplifier as well with two in outputs, one here and one the other side. Then we have AirPlay 2 Blue OS High Res, of course. ERC HDMI with Dolby Digital, of course. Arun Ready, the Iraq Live Ready works with Tidal Connect, Spotify Connect. Has five buttons here to program and you know to have direct access to the sources. In front here we can see volume control, it's here. Control. So the app is this one, we have Bluetooth inputs, customized source, analog, analog input, optical input, HDMI, ER, with different settings here, even, even AV mode and lip sync delay. We have a USB-C with the same settings here to play, to set up, so accepts remote control and IR codes, indicator brightness, uh, dim, normal. Proximity sensor, the one that lights up the buttons here. LCD brightness, we can, uh, of the screen, we can increase the brightness. Clock standby, clock view, we can have digital, uh, it depends, uh, we, have, we can have digital clock like, like this one. But we can have an uh, analog one, this one, or uh, this one, much bigger this one. Okay, it has a, lo a lot of languages, as you can see, all the countries. What else? Uh, that's it, guys. Uh, then we have uh, the player. You see the volume there. Then we have audio settings, tone controllers here. You see bass and treble. Subwoofer uh, with crossover, 80 hertz now. We can go, we'll go, we'll go for 40 to 200 hertz. A replay game, output mode, stereo, left, right, mono. We can... Uh, Turn to mono, you will like. Here there is a lot of customization, a lot of adjustments because this product can be used in a custom installation as well. It has a lot of features. It's a streamer, but it's very open in terms of adjustment. Here we have, here we have direct access to the inputs. For example, eARC or uh, optical, USB-C, Bluetooth, analog in. We can play a radio as well, you see, different uh, stations, so you just check here and the station arrives on our player. So we can do the, the Tidal Connect easily, we see the album there, for example, you see the album there. It's a beautiful large screen. The screen is big, but the album is square. You cannot do it bigger. You, you need a bigger form device in order to make it bigger. Says here the details about the track. On the back, on the back, guys, we have uh, analog input, of course. Analog input, this one. We have uh, outputs, XLR and RCA. Then we have sub out subwoofer output, coaxial digital out, two opt one optical in, one optical out, USB to, to connect, uh, you know, external uh, drivers that they contain music files to playback, Ethernet, if we don't like to use the Wi-Fi, then we have we there this input, which is the USB DAC, we can connect our laptop there, smartphone, whatever, or even, or another streamer, external streamer, if we like. And then we can connect our TV here and play and use it as a soundbar with uh, Blue OS speakers, wireless ones, or other systems, active speakers, for example. Here, connect them here. We connect it like this. You see ARC TV on the back. We can use the remote of the TV in order to control the sound, you see, even the TV is taking the command of the audio. This board here says THX. Probably this is the headphone amplifier of the product. 
Then we have three ESS, two for uh, left and right channel. Here you see the two symmetric ones. Two channels you see is exactly the same. Then we have one more ESS here. Here we have the XLRs there. XLRs. Network. And somewhere underneath the board, this board, is the Cortex CPU that controls everything. So guys, this is the icon blue sound. It has everything, this product. It's a headphone amplifier, it's a streamer, network player, a multi-room player. And the power supply is this one here, on the bottom of the device. The power supply is set switch in one, as you can see. With this uh, white gum there, that stops the vibration of the components. There is a fuse here. So this is the power supply of the icon, blue sound. So I think you got an idea of what's going on here. Straightforward, big display in front. It's you cannot touch. It's not touch. You use the app for everything. In the box, there is no remote control. This beautiful product. So guys, that's all. We measured the headphone amplifier. We did an in-depth analysis. We checked the inputs and the output. This is the new blue sound icon. Thanks for watching. See you next time.